All right, so we're here at this long overdue video. Super busy, but uh, I thought the process was going to be more complicated than it actually is. Actually, if you know how to patch PS1 version, you, you already know how to do the PSP because the process is identical. The only thing you would need differently is um, go over here to, you, you definitely need, you're just going to need a PSP emulator. I, I recommend PPSSP, which is, and I'm on the website here. You just click the installer. And you set it up, and then you have everything ready to go on this folder here. And then we have the Lavalaria mod, which is also all the all the mod, you can find all the mods you ever need on uh, fftactics.com uh, on the forums. But this is the Valeria mod. This is a PSP mod. Just to let you know. Make sure you have an uh, ISO of uh, the the War of Lions version, not uh, the regular, the rigid OG. We're just gonna make a folder here. Like we did before, I would normally I would type it, but I'm, I'm trying to record it a little differently than I did last time. I'm trying to do it live here, so we make, I'm just gonna put what we do before. We're gonna put these two files in here. Pretend that I named it uh, Valeria mod, and we're just gonna open up Piffomatic. I, I I think I forgot to show you Piffomatic here. I just got it from you. Can, it's just a ROM tool. It allows you to patch PlayStation uh, format, and I guess I guess uh, apparently since it's a PlayStation portable, I guess it's very similar to like original PlayStation. So now we're just gonna go to our new folder on the desktop here, mark new folder, whatever you named it. Show it. I was like, let's say I definitely click on desktop. The ISO file, which is on here, which is the FFT. Original. Normally, uh, I would have you copy it. I would. I suggest you copy it so you can have to use it for few further use. But this is just a demonstration. But uh, you can always just download it again or use the patch. And then here's the patch for this. And all you gotta do is click apply. And then I would suggest uh, you rename your file so you know what it is. I will. I'm not gonna play this mod, so I'm just not gonna bother with that. And now I'm just going to go to my folder over here and we're going to open up our emulator, which is a uh, Windows 64 is the one I like to use. It's got a load here. Not very really experienced using the PSP. Uh, what you call it? The emulator here. So give me a second to find where this file is. Uh, go to got to go to desktop. A new folder. Open this up. See if I got my controller ready. I should, so we should be good. Actually, I don't think my controls are set up because this is a different version. One sec, I'm just going to hit a button. This is all for the check. gonna hit reset i i think you saw it that it said valeria mod but i hit i hit the space button too quickly there so i'm just going to show you that real quick and there you go they've got the valeria mod ready to go it's the exact same process as the ps1 so you can even go back and do the same thing and watch the old video and there i was tempted to like just say hey but now i just decided to make a separate video just in case somebody wants specifically the psp version and that's how you do it so you're good to go and I'm going to sign off here. Come back to the channel. Keep bringing it to you. Like, comment, subscribe, and see ya.